Today's saint was like a medieval rock star who never stopped touring Europe. He travelled with an entourage, drew enormous crowds and was wildly popular and called the cream of society his friends. The details of St. Bernard's life are abundantly documented. He was a prolific writer, but primarily via letters, not thick books. And these letters outline his character in sharp profile. He was intelligent, emotional, erudite, forceful and contemplative. He spoke and wrote poetically, beautifully, clearly and deeply. Pope Pius XII called him the last of the fathers of the church. Bernard was born in a castle to a high-born family and was sent away by his parents during his youth to receive a classical education. In 1111, at the age of 22, he decided to join a monastery. His five brothers, two uncles and some 30 young friends followed him into the monastery. Within four years, a dying community had recovered enough vitality to establish a new house that would become known as Clairvaux. Bernard stamped his Cistercian movement with its distinctive character. Sobriety in art and architecture, solemnity in liturgy, austerity in life, industrious in labour, strictness in observance of the rule, and silence pervading all. For an austere contemplative monk, Bernard, ironically, spent much of his life on the road. His gifts were such that he was consulted by princes and kings and popes on every imaginable issue. He participated in church councils, mediated civil conflicts, inaugurated crusades, and wrote commentaries on prayer, theology, and scripture. Bernard's authentic and tender devotion to the Virgin Mary was expressed sublimely in his writings, which in many ways are still the foundation of Marian theology today. For all his writings, leadership skills, and charismatic personality, Bernard knew that without the discipline of prayer and reflection, all his efforts would come to naught. To consciously establish a daily routine and set aside some quality time in prayer and reflection might be the best advice our saint of the day can give. <laughs>